really thank uh, one a very important gentleman who brought us here, which is the uh, General of the Air Force, Pa Agus Supriana uh, Kaus. Uh, he is from Kasaud, actually. Uh, when, he, when I told him that we have a special liquid, he said, why don't you help our people in Indonesia? Now, we, why you tell me that we had a passion to help uh, the people of Indonesia, especially the little children, because the haze has really taken a very big, a very big height where uh, people are really suffering, including kids. So we decided to do it on a humanitarian ground, uh, and we needed the help of someone who can uh, uh, pass through the uh, uh, bureaucratic. Uh, this is why General uh, Agus uh, from the Air Force who helped us, and we we did it, and we had a lot of uh, encourage. We are very encouraged because. Within two days, we mobilized everything, uh, including our equipment, including our liquid, and we saw the smile in many people when they saw that the peat fire was going down. Uh, a lot of people came to see how the peat fire uh, exercise was conducted. So we did uh, tremendously well, uh, and we knocked down the fire very quickly, and the uh, Air Force, uh, Mr. Andre, Andre was very happy because he was personally involved in bringing it down and every other Air Force and uh, land uh, force commandos were involved with us uh, because the spread was quite big uh, on the peat fire and uh, we were very happy to work with them and uh, at last Indonesia Riau has found a solution and BNBP was also with us and everyone had a solution and now they brought we, we, we brought in about 2,000 liter. Now they have taken it to other part of uh, Riau to uh, kind of a knock down the peat fire, which is underground. As you know, the peat fire is not easy to knock down because it has been brewing there for at least a month or so. And the underground fire has been built up tremendously deeply inside. So uh, it was very interesting to see the strength of our liquid fire terminator, JN1010 and fire terminator solve the problem on the peat fire. So today we have uh, uh, achieved a very big achievement for fire terminator solution. And we saw the smile in many people out here, especially the Air Force uh, uh, general out here also, and also the BNP, the Bupati, a lot of them came and they were pretty happy uh, uh, with what has taken place and how we knocked down the fire. And we are also very encouraged and what we plan to do here is to set up a factory in order to uh, mitigate losses in future. Thank you. What's your view uh, from your program? Uh, as I said, uh, my program now, uh, we are going to uh, go into the forest fire problem tomorrow and uh, eventually to achieve what we are looking for uh, with the, the Air Force of Indonesia. Um, we are really wanting to be a, a, a help in any way to do a knockdown, we call it, in fire, to extinguish the fire uh, in Indonesia, at least in certain area right now. We know that it's in Kalimantan, we know that it's in Papua, we know back again in, uh, in uh, Palembang that the fire has uh, taken a different height. So we are trying to get into these places because we have the liquid that is able to knock down fire within seconds with very little water involved than to use a big amount of water. And at the same time, uh, we, we, our uh, spraying capacity is two minutes, we can spray about three, 700 liters. So we have a very uh, interesting uh, way of extinguishing compared to water bombing. Water bombing is also good, but water bombing takes three hours to do 500 liter. So we do two minutes, 750 liter. But now what we are doing is, uh, we have spoken to the Air Force and uh, uh, pa Andre has decided and BNBP has decided we will put some of our liquid into the uh, water, uh, water bucket to do the water bombing and I'm pretty sure it will be a very good achievement there. What's your guarantee, your, pro uh, your uh, uh, no, uh, product will work? Now, I am very sure that the product will work because uh, this is a A and B fire. My product, our product can handle A and B fire. Now, in an A and B fire, basically what we do, we knock down the free radical molecule that has taken its height uh, because it's a big buildup in the forest fire. So, uh, we are very, 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 very positive 
of the achievement of knocking down this fire if his application is done according to uh, my research, how I uh, do, do the application. So the standard SOP has to be done. And I have briefed them and they have agreed to follow uh, the system. So we, we are very confident that uh, the fire will be knocked down. What do you hope uh, your program and your product in the future? We really hope that uh, the government see it in a very objective manner and uh, we are given the chance to try in different parts of Indonesia uh, without much uh, delay in time. Like what happened now is very fast and very quick. So we hope the other regions will welcome us in that manner where we can quickly do something. And then, as I said, uh, we have a very serious interest to set up a factory so that we can do uh, manufacturing in Indonesia because raw materials are available in Indonesia where we can be prepared and set up a solution for such problem. We also do hardware, so we have the software and the hardware so we can really work something out uh, with the locals. What do you see Indonesia and your look on Indonesia? What do you see? Now, I basically find that uh, and, and the people of Indonesia are very welcoming. Uh, they are clever when we show them how to use the machine, how to use the liquid. They're pretty hardworking. Uh, uh, most of them in the ground and even the generals and the officers, they have a very strong interest to help out. They have a very strong interest to bring this down. Indonesia is working. Uh, the people of Indonesia, are they're working together right now to bring the fire problem down. It's a national interest that I see in everyone uh, that I deal with. Although there is a bureaucratic problem, that is something that can be handled. But when you get into the system, you can see everyone is really doing their part, really trying to bring down the fire and the haze. So that encourages me very much. Okay. Thank you.
No way, no way, no way. Jimmy, kalau Jimmy, kalau kalau kita tidak adam itu cepat-cepat dia bisa naik sekali. Bawa selang si situ pak, tolong bawa selang situ kita bisa semprot ini dulu cepat-cepat. Kalau tak ada dia naik banyak itu. Kita bisa lihat bersama di sini, rakan-rakan sekalian. Sore ini kita berada di Bukit Bungku, Syabu. Ini adalah lokasi titik api yang sedang berlangsung saat ini, untuk kegiatan kita ini. Ini ketinggiannya kurang lebih hampir 800 meter. Jadi kendala kita di sini, petugas kita ada beliau dari tim ya dari Singapura, ya, kemudian kita juga dari Laut, dari Brimob, kemudian dari uh, orang Amil juga bersama-sama di sini. Kita berupaya memadamkan api yang berada di puncak bukit ini. Kendala kita adalah masalah uh, ketinggian dan medan yang sulit dijangkau, kemudian kualitas alat yang dapat mendukung air menuju ke situ sangat sulit sekali. Jadi demikian kondisinya uh, untuk kita bersama. Saat ini kita berupaya memadamkan api secara manual. Jadi kita punya alat yang dibantu oleh Pak uh, beliau ini, Pak Juda ini, alat yang dapat Uh, seperti lukit untuk memadamkan api itu kita campur dengan air opsi terakhir adalah kita menggunakan manual ya, seperti alat penyemprot uh, tanaman itu kita gunakan seperti itu uh, untuk lebih efektifnya jadi perlu kita kembali lagi ke depannya bagaimana mengatasi situasi kebakaran di medan seperti ini demikian uh, mohon kenapa tidak dicampurkan uang sendiri seperti ini ya ini tidak sangat safety sekali di luar prosedur untuk uh, kegerakan pesawat helikopter tidak bisa sangat ketat sekali dan jangan pandang manual seperti ini menuju titik sasaran ya naik sedikit seperti ini ada yang lagi ini kita 
hampir dari kita pasca 15 orang ditambah rekan-rekan dari Bimok juga hampir satu regu kemudian dari Koramil dibantu Pak ya orang dari Polres juga ya, kita sama-sama ada masyarakat juga di sini ini sudah tempat ini sudah terbakar kurang lebih selama tiga hari kurang lebih jadi kita upayakan mungkin ke dianggapkan besok atau mungkin kita lebih efektif lagi ke penyiapan alat untuk sekarang ini secara manual campur alat ataupun cair tersebut dengan air yang seadanya yang bisa kita dapatkan dari bawah nah, kita coba bagaimana tingkat aktivitasnya kita lihat nanti bagaimana hasilnya namun sekali lagi sangat terbatas sekali karena menggunakan manual ya. mungkin ada yang tambahkan bapak silakan bisa dulu ya sejauh ini apa uh, yang anda kebakaran hutan ini ya tapi ini ya uh, macam komando bilang ini tinggi sekali kan sudah macam 8 ke 900 uh, 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 atas gunung gitu ya uh, komandan udah siap semua yang ba paling bagus punya sistem semua uh, tapi kita tahu kan ini ter terlalu tinggi sekali tapi komandan punya second idea yang semprot uh, immediately itu ada efektif